All right, so as the rupee is falling, there are other commodities, the prices of which are rising, and diesel has now touched a lifetime high of 70.21 rupees per litre in the national capital, crossing the 70 per litre mark for the first time, while the price of petrol has hit a record high of 78.52. The diesel prices in Delhi today witness a 28 paise rise per litre. In the country's financial hub, Mumbai, where the fuel prices are the highest, diesel was retailing at 74.54 per litre. And in Kolkata, a litre of diesel now costs 73.06. Petrol prices have also gone up pretty sharply by around 21 paise per litre to 81.44 in Kolkata to rupees 85.93 per litre in Mumbai. And the fuel prices have been on the boil since the 16th of August after the rupee has depreciated to its lowest value against the dollar. The fuel prices in Delhi are considered to be one of the cheapest in all metros and most state capitals due to lower sales tax or VAT. The diesel price had previously hit its highest level on the 29th of May when it had breached the 69.31 mark per litre in Delhi, but now it has breached the 70 rupee mark. The petroleum prices may in fact continue to go up as the international markets are under severe pressure due to sanctions or the threat of sanctions on Iran and Saudi Arabia's decision to cut oil production. Now, Iran, which is the second biggest oil exporter to India and also the third largest oil producer in the OPEC group, is all set to plunge into a crisis once the United States sanctions come into full effect from the 1st of November and therefore over the period of the next two, three months, the prices of petrol and diesel could in fact take a bit of a beating. Now, high prices have off and on triggered demands for reduction in the excise duty, but the government has ruled out any immediate relief to the people. Now, the centre currently levies a total of about 19.48 rupees per litre. That is the amount of money that is going into the central government's kitty, about 19.48 rupees per litre every time you purchase petrol. And also 15 rupees and 33 paise is, is the amount of taxes so which just the central government collects per litre of diesel and the state governments collect a pretty much equal amount of the share. Now on top of this, the states of course levy their taxes as well. Now the lowest price of fuel is in the Andaman and Nicobar Islands where a 6% sales tax is charged on both fuels.